Uh, let's get right to it. All the details you need to know, they are right here. Let's start out with this morning's forecast. Now, it is chilly out there this morning. Temperatures are in the 30s. We're waking up to some sunshine to start the day, but we are actually going to be about 30 degrees colder than what we are right now by Friday morning. So keep that in mind. It's cold now, but it is about to get so much colder. Now this afternoon we will see some more cloud cover move in, but temperatures will still be in the 50s. So if you do have any last minute grocery shopping or last minute gift shopping to do, today is the day to do it because this is really the last calm, quiet and nice day we will have really until Christmas because it's going to stay cold once it gets cold. Here's the hour by hour forecast. We're going to start things off tomorrow morning. Now tomorrow morning won't be too bad. We're going to start off in the 40s and 50s, maybe with a little bit of light rain, but here comes our cold front and once it hits you, temperatures are going to fall dramatically. You're going to notice the winds pick up. It's going to be a bitterly cold wind and temperatures are going to plummet by 2 p.m. 53 in Memphis. 33 in Wynn, Arkansas. That's just a few miles there, so you can see how quickly those temperatures are going to drop. And as the front comes through, any rain that is there is going to quickly transition to snow. So by 4 p.m. tomorrow in Memphis, 29 degrees, that rain will have switched over to snow. Snow in Covington and Dyersburg by then. Still 53 in Oxford with some rain by 4 o'clock. But again, that cold air quickly moves in. By 5 or 6 p.m., everybody for the most part is below freezing. Everybody is seeing some snow. And we will see snow continue in Memphis from about 3 p.m., through 7 or 8 p.m. Notice though that snow moves out fairly quickly. It's only going to be a few hours of snow and it's going to be generally light snow. By 8 p.m. tomorrow, just some light showers and light snow showers left over in Corinth. But again, even that quickly moves out by 9 p.m. The snow will be done for everybody, but the air is going to remain very cold. Check this out. Friday morning, 6 a.m., 7 degrees in Memphis, 3 degrees in Somerville and Dyersburg, 10 in Clarksdale, Mississippi. So how much snow can we expect? Well, here's the latest snow accumulation map. Generally, we're talking about a dusting to less than an inch, maybe a little bit over a half an inch in some spots, but in Memphis, I really think it's going to be less than an inch of snow because it's going to be fairly light snow. It's not going to last that long and the winds are going to be so breezy that it's not going to be able to stick that well. Now, north of Memphis on Highway 51 from Covington up to Ripley and Dyersburg, that's where we could see a little bit over an inch, maybe closer to two inches. But in general, we don't expect the snow to be that impactful. It's going to be pretty to look at through the Christmas weekend. We could have some snow hang around through Christmas. But in general, I think the roadways for the most part are going to be OK. Your winter impact index on a scale of one to five, five being the worst. Everybody's in that blue level one right now. What that means is most of your roads will be fine. But there could certainly be some slick spots Thursday night into Friday. So if you do have to hit the roads, use caution, be careful. But I don't expect this to be a catastrophic winter storm in terms of snowfall. What's going to be the bigger story is the cold air. Your wind chills Friday morning once that snow moves out. 18 below in Dyersburg, 13 below in Memphis. 10 below zero in Tunica. So this could be deadly cold, folks. You got to check on your people. Bring in your pets. I'm sorry if you leave your pet out in this. You're just not a good person and protect your pipes. I'm serious. I hate to say it like that, but it's true. I mean, if you're cold, they're just as cold. You got to bring them inside, folks. Seven day forecast today. Get your grocery shopping done. 52 much colder tomorrow afternoon. We'll start off at 50. We're going to fall to seven by Thursday night. Again, we'll look out for some snow tomorrow, 3 p.m. to about 7 p.m. Bitterly cold Friday, high of 17 with gusty winds. Cold through the weekend, 24 Christmas Eve, 28 Christmas Day. We will climb up a little bit back to near 40 by Monday and Tuesday. So a short lived cold snap, but it is going to be very dramatic, especially on Friday.